Are you having a tough time coming up with marketing ideas for your products or services? Or maybe you're having difficulties managing all the different digital marketing channels for your business. Hey, what up Decisive Marketers? Today, we're going to be talking about Ply.io and what this tool does, it connects with Facebook ads, Google Ads, as well as TikTok Ads and Google Analytics to give you an accurate representation of your ROI. And on top of that, uh, it also generates landing pages for you and gives you tools for you to create uh, ads for your business, right? So before I dive into Ply.io, be sure to hit that subscribe button if you'd like to see the more digital marketing and e-commerce content. So here we go. So here we are in Ply.io. I'm just going to go into my uh, dashboard right here. So. Uh, this is one of the uh, tools that I use, uh, sorry, one of the websites that I manage. Okay, so I've connected with Google Ads. Uh, at the moment, this store is not uh, running with any Facebook ads or TikTok ads right now. So uh, on uh, my, uh, so I've also connected to Google Analytics. Okay, so if you find Google Analytics difficult to understand, uh, I think that Ply.io makes it easier for you. Uh, it tells you like what's this month's uh, data, what's last month's data, right? So uh, this month's uh, revenue is $31,000 and it's up 61.57%. So this is month uh, This month itself is very good, right? Uh, this is month to date. I believe this would also be month to date. Uh, so, you know, sales are up. Uh, tremendously next is a uh, conversion rate uh, which is a little weird right here uh, probably you know GA4 is, uh, is not maybe set up properly I guess uh, because I don't think I have proper conversion tracking set up for this site at the moment uh, and not on top of that uh, you can see the sessions number right here you can see the the channels that are working well uh, so page search has 38 uh, conversions uh, organic search has 36 right and then direct traffic page shopping uh referrals uh, emails uh, and unassigned right and then you can also look at the landing page and you can see which page gives me the most traffic which one gives me the most uh revenue so i can see right here right which uh, you know which one has the most users which one has the most conversion uh, or better but com best conversion rates right here okay so next you can also look at the advertising uh, this is where i've connected to google ads uh, facebook ads and tiktok ads uh, just google ads right here but i can see like what's the spend how many impressions have i had uh, the number of clicks the cost per uh, click, the average cost per click, and the uh, cost per 1,000 impressions, uh, cost uh, see click through rate, okay, and the cost per view interactions, cost per uh, conversion, okay. So those data are in here. Uh, this is over the you know past sort of 30 days or so, okay. Right. So that's where you connect everything, and uh, you know. This, this is what Ply does. And then, of course, if you want to run ads right here, you can, you know, you can choose what kind of ads you want to run. So let's say if it's a uh, Facebook ads, you can click on it. And uh, so it it is a simpler uh, version. Let me just kind of turn off my ad card right here. Okay. So Google search, uh, you know, so it's a much easier way to set up your, uh, sorry, this is Facebook ads, but this is a simpler way for you to set up your uh, marketing ads uh, using, uh, you know, uh, ply.io, right? Uh, rather than using the ads manager of these performance marketing uh, channels itself okay uh, I mean that dashboard which can be very confusing if you're not good at it right um, so this is your Google uh, keyword ads this is what it looks like so these are the keywords that they recommend me to run ads for okay and then uh, kind of creative so this all done for you right so this is why it's amazing because it saves you a lot of time uh, you know setting up those ads next is you know for example this is Facebook ads and it gives you the uh, you know, uh, gives you a, uh, you know, kind of gives you an idea how it looks like, right? So I think this one's kind of nice. 
so you can set this up right so it gives you all very nice uh, ads that's all all sort of done for you right it saves you a lot of time and uh, you know if you if you hate um, you know uh, running ads you know this this will help you a lot okay right so this is Facebook Right, because I don't have a Facebook connected right here, so I mean this is good for you. But it, you know, it's pretty much a simplified version of the Facebook Ads Manager. Okay, the next thing, this is where the cool stuff starts to happen, uh, because we, you know, tools like you know having a dashboard, uh, have creating ads for you. You know, we have covered that in my channel. But what this tool does is of cool right so uh you can have for example just kind of put in uh, let's say i want to put in my business right so uh okay so let's say i'll put that in uh and then features would be uh blocks with Tons of information recommended uh, softwares to uh, so let's say something like that and then on top of that you can add a contact form uh, you can put in your business address, your phone number, email, social media links in there. And then what happens is that you can create your website, right? So uh, let's see, we want to put in the email, something like this. Uh, then we'll put, let's say, my Facebook in there. Just something like this, right? And then we'll create, please generate content. So we'll create the you know generate the content and then uh you see so this is what happens right it creates the landing page for me right it creates the landing page for me and then all i need to do upload my logo right and add a cover image and i have a landing page ready to go uh you see so uh you know it is i i guess they sort of use ai to do this and they can create website and then it's done right the website is done so i have a landing page done for me right and this you know with filled with you know uh the illustrations and all that this is sort of you know ready to go right so and then uh you know you you have you have your contact forms in here right so when they fill that in it's going to full, uh, fill up the database in here right and then on top of that uh, lastly this is where uh what another cool stuff is found which is the research tools right so you can put in the keywords so let's say uh you know put in digital marketing then uh you can put in you know where you are so let's say singapore then you click next and ply is going to come up with ideas for you so for example this keyword is uh has about five thousand searches per month uh you know online marketing has 260 digital marketing agency has a thousand dollars uh, sorry a thousand uh, volume and so on and it gives you the average cpc right so uh digital marketing is about three dollars per click uh, online marketing is about four dollars digital marketing agency is about five dollars four dollars blah, blah blah so these are all the keywords that you have uh, you can use this to run your uh, Google Ads. Next is trending content. So let's see, we'll put in digital marketing again. And what kind of type is it? Uh, you know, if it's all, just click on all. And what happens is that Ply is going to pull out all the most viral content. Okay. Uh, or the most, you know, trending content. So for example, like this, uh, this one probably has, uh, you know, these are sort of like the top, uh, you know, uh, content out there so you can look at them and then come up with ideas to use it to run uh you know ads for yourself 
or you know content on your uh you know your website and then you can you know of on your social media right you can share that on your social media okay which is more likely to be you know more viral and then the last one is uh marketing tips from sort of i guess this is probably like some sort of uh, ai or that okay so they'll give you some tips right so if you know nothing about running ads then uh, so for example if you have yet to identify your successful keywords try to increase specific city things like fruit juice versus the versus a keyword for food will yield better results right and then uh, specific locations make sure your your ad text is working uh, headline and all that start with a ten dollar a day budget then set your beats for the top of the page Feelings need help, right? So hit the launch page to get started. Okay, so let's try marketing. So ask me, ask me, ask me, ask me, ask me, ask me. Okay. So these are some tips for you to sort of grow your business, right? It's all in here. Uh, they give you some simple tips in here in there right so that's all uh, there is to apply um, I think that where the more exciting features are would definitely be the landing page generator for me right it creates the general uh, landing page uh, for you right it generates the landing page for you and then it holds it up right and of course you can even I think like sort of create a C name for it and you can have it as your own own uh sort of website in there right so you can change like the url uh i, I believe so uh you know uh and then you or you can just use plies uh you know landing page itself and run ads and start getting leads from there okay and i think the dashboard is also pretty uh you know pretty uh you know very very easy way for you to understand how your business is running all from ply itself so i guess that's all i have to share about ply i think overall it's a worthy tool i think it's pretty good that definitely needs to be more work to be done but it's uh, looking like it's heading towards the right direction so you uh, that's all I have to share about Ply. If you enjoyed this video, do give me a thumbs up. Let me know what you do, uh, what you think about Ply in the comments below. Lastly, if you know anyone who could benefit from Ply, be sure to share this video with them. I'll see you in my next video. Bye bye.